What is going on everybody? Welcome back. So what do we got going today? It's kind of a poop situation. This is the wheel that was supposed to be on this little Camco, what is it, a little Camco Rhino looking thing. One of those things. So if you have something like that, stay tuned. Might have a little fix for you. Dumping our tanks the other day and uh, wheel came off. Slid about, I don't know, five, six, maybe even 10 feet. I wasn't going maybe four miles per hour. Um, they put these little pressure nuts on there. Just hammer them on and they're supposed to stay. But you got a couple hundred pounds riding in there and those pressure nuts, they just, I guess mine just came off. So we're gonna do a little fixing. Also, got this little thing right here. We got to do a little fixing because it, dr it, it drug on the road. Uh, we put a hole in it. So I got some of this JB Weld water weld. So we'll see how this stuff works. I don't know. So this little water weld comes in uh, putty. So I've been uh, kneading this just so it's all kind of uniform color get it all ready to go here and basically the hole is right where it drug I'm gonna put a couple coats on this thing um, takes about 25 minutes to to set up and then you know an hour to cure so where it did drag on the ground it did roll the plastic I did clean it up but they said to leave it kind of rough so just kind of cleaned off all the loose stuff and I'm going with it All right, I think that's good enough for uh, the first coat here. I'm going to get cleaned up a little bit, and then uh, while that is drying, we're going to work on the other project. Go ahead and pop that off. And that is all that holds this wheel on. Just set that up there. How we're going to do this is we're going to take the washer that was on the inside we're going to move that to the outside so of course you have the bearings on the wheels we're going to throw that there it's like a i don't know what you call it, like a, a a fluted axle i don't know but it's bigger so it can't go any further than that take the washer that was on the inside we're going to put that on the outside Take handy dandy sharpie and mark right there. Take that off and what I ended up I ended up getting at that loads there is a 530 seconds cotter pin. We're gonna put that on the end of it. Bend it over so we can pull all the poop we want to around. Uh, go ahead and wheel on, washer on. Slide your cotter pin through that hole that you just drilled. There we go. That. And it rolls just like how it should. Or on the other side, same thing. I'll tell you what. It took a hammer to get that other nut off. It's that little, little pressure nut, whatever that thing is called. If they would have done that on the other side. I wouldn't even be able to make a video right now. Cause there's no way in hell that thing would have came off. There's our 5:30 second hole. Good night, Camco. You should have done that on the other side. All right, you got that all drilled out. Got the cotter pin in. Did a. Uh, another layer built it up pretty good and we are done washer get that cotter pin in there but if you do get in a situation like that think about a little cotter pin in there drill it out hopefully this thing will work gonna be giving her a try out here very shortly it only take a few days so till next time guys hey 
Throw the bones.